Hi, it's Laura with Following the Paper Trail, and it is the first day of Christmas Projects 2013. I wasn't sure I was going to be able to do the Christmas Projects this year, and I wanted to make sure that I could do all 12 before I started, and it looks like it's going to work. Now, they're not going to be absolutely every day for 12 days straight, but we will get 12 of them in before Christmas. This first one is a super simple idea that you can use to make a hostess gift or a gift for somebody in your office, that sort of thing. What you can use is just some real simple, basic, plain candles. These are just some plain candles that I got at Ikea. So they're unscented, just super simple. And then I've just made some cute little easy to make decorations little candle pins. They're made with just your basic thumbtack. And then here on this one, I've just used some punches and some bling for in the center. And then you just poke them in to the side of the candle. It's as easy as that. I've added a little bit of uh, punch detail along the bottom of the candle. That's just, um, I just used some adhesive to stick that down. On this one, I've got um, three of the little thumbtack pieces, and I've just had added a piece of ribbon that isn't even stuck down at all. It's stuck down solely with the little candle pin tack. These guys here, I've used uh, some little um, trinkets, the little metal trinkets from some Bow Bunny that I had in my stash, and added just some little poinsettia flowers to them and then it's super easy you just poke them right down into the side of your candle quick fast literally minutes to put together what would be a delightful hostess gift during the holidays so for instance with this one I just took a couple of uh, punch snowflakes you could use die cuts you could use as I said, using some little trinkets, some some flowers. Um, there's a multitude of things that you could use. Um, I, you know, I'm a big big on punches and such. So, um, so I've just taken these. I'm just going to use some glue dots, super fast to put together. Line up these two different punch. One's a Martha Stewart punch. One's an EK Success punch. <coughs> Excuse me. Layer those together. I've given some dimension to the top one by kind of bending the, the little snowflake arms out. And then I just take, these are just your basic thumbtacks that you can get pretty much anywhere, just little metal, relatively flat little thumbtacks. And I'm just going to put, you can use glue. I'm going to use some um, glue dots here. Well, that one kind of mangled up a little bit, but anyway take these white things out of the way a little bit so then I don't my light works better I'm going to just stick this on to the back of this punch piece this way also too you could have candles that you could change them out with the seasons this is Christmas you could turn them into um, whatever holiday that you need to <coughs> excuse me I'm going to use some of these little Prima bling medallions that I had in my stash of goodies We'll put another one of these guys in the center of this one. Let's pick this guy right here. And these are cool because they stick all together. They're nice and intricate, but they kind of act like one single sticker. <laughs> so we'll just pop that guy into the center. That's how fast these are to make. Um, and as I said, I just added a punched edge onto here. Let's just stick this guy here in this back side. So it could be two sided. You could add it to all four sides if you want. And you just stab it down into your candle. How cute is that? I probably, with that, I'd want to do it on all four sides. But it makes just such a really pretty way to just dress up a really super inexpensive basic candle. Lots of fun. All you need is a few embellishments and some thumbtacks and some candles. And you can turn it in to something super fast, super easy, super pretty. 
So, anyway, looking forward to 11 more projects of Christmas. Thanks for joining me, and we'll see you soon. Thanks a bunch.